Hey, what's up guys? This is Dark Dally, and this video will be the inaugural video to my new uh, YouTube channel. Um, as you can probably tell, I like to play Fallout 4, and I definitely like to build settlements. Um, this is the latest settlement I built here in Sanctuary Hills. Um, I spent a lot of time since the release of this game learning all the tips and tricks that I could of uh, building settlements, putting things together that aren't supposed to go together, and creating in my opinion, some really cool aesthetics and structures. Now, I have to do lots of other things as well, and there will be many more videos forthcoming. But, uh, oh yeah, let's uh, take a quick tour of my little town sanctuary here. When I first started building towns, um, I did probably what everyone does, which is just build a really big-ass building with like five or six floors, and then it ends up being impossible to navigate, and uh, settlers get stuck on the second flight of stairs and can't follow you. Oh my god, shut up, Ada. I swear, when she is in range she never shuts up but uh, anyway as I continued building I toned myself down and said okay what creates a more successful town is having lots of buildings like this and creating a nice little town I've turned this particular sanctuary into mostly a farming community um, for making lots and lots of adhesive um, if you guys don't know how to uh, make adhesive it's a uh, vegetable starch it takes uh, mute fruit and corn. My corn is planted over behind uh, the house over there. And potatoes. I only have a few potatoes planted here because they're so plentiful around the Commonwealth. But um, let me go over here real quick. With this uh, particular little farming community I have going on here, um, you be careful. we can see that uh, right now, yeah, I got 590 adhesive just kicking here because I got all this stuff to farm. Anyway, so this is primarily a farming community. And uh, I've got, oh, about 14 settlers all assigned to farming. But what I really wanted to show is a particular architectural technique I think is really cool. If you guys want to know how to do this, I would be glad to make a video showing you how. I was really happy when I figured out how to do this. Um, one day I wanted to build a building with a big overhang. And I said to myself, wouldn't it be cool if I could use stairs like some kind of support beam? Well, it took several trials and many errors. And uh, I finally really got the hang of it. Um, something I'm really proud of. Uh, if I get a positive response for this, then I'll, uh, and I probably will anyway, I'll make a nice instructional video on exactly how to do this, but it creates a really cool look um, using stairs in this fashion. Um, a lot of the tricks in, in settlement building have to do with when it comes to putting things where they aren't supposed to go, it comes to uh, the order that you put them in. Sometimes it won't let you do something, and it can be frustrating. It's like, man, why can't I do this? I, you know, this one part would look really good right here. And then you realize if you back up and try a different order of operations, you can get stuff to work that shouldn't work. Um, you've probably already seen, uh, I do have the Wasteland Workshop DLC. I really like it. Being savvy um, in settlement building, I ate it up and uh, I already found a lot of good things. I haven't experimented with uh, creatures in cages yet because, well, I just don't have the perks on this character to do that. I have other characters to do, but I'm playing this guy right now. Um, these lights are one of my favorite aspects of the Wasteland Workshop. These track lights, they're great for creating a nice little spot of light where we want them. I've got them used here, up on the roof here. I got a little power armor storage area going, and uh, again, I have the lights here. Those lights are great for uh, focus lighting. This, uh, this new DLC did a lot that I really like with lighting. Um, if you look out here, you'll see I've also made use of the oil lamps. I love the oil lighting. It's that warm like light, like right here. This this is the lamp that comes with Sanctuary and you can't take it out and you can't move it. And it always made the most awesome, soft, warm glow that I always wanted. And finally now they gave us the lights to do this. I'm um, busy. I love them. I love the oil lights. Anyway, so uh, I'm Dark Dally and uh, I'll be making a new channel. Um, this is my new channel. Focus in right now on Fallout 4 and particularly at the moment on um, settlement building. I got lots of tips and tricks I can show you guys. Um, not just my tricky little support beams here. I've made some really interesting uh, buildings and also any uh, fun gameplay faux pas that happen to happen and I capture on video. Um, Alright, thanks for watching guys and hope to see you next time.